I was asked what I do with ripe bananas. The result is amazing. In a blender, add four bananas, two eggs. Also, add two cups of milk and blend well. Tell me what recipe you make when you have ripe bananas in your house. I would love to know your recipes. You guys, this recipe is very easy to make and is incredibly delicious. Make it at home and then come back here to tell me what you thought. I'm sure you'll love it. In a pan, add one cup of sugar and stir constantly on low heat until caramelized. And before I forget, tell me where you are watching us from so I can send you a special hug. Today's hug is for BB Shaman from Florida. I'm happy to hear that you're loving our recipes. Add half cup of water little by little while stirring like this. You guys, this recipe is very easy to make and is incredibly delicious. Make it at home and then come back here to tell me what you thought. I'm sure you'll love it. Add our syrup in a pudding mold. Spread it well on the sides just like I'm doing. Then transfer the mixture, which we just beat, inside the mold. Cover it with aluminum foil. Place it inside a larger mold. Add water halfway through it. And bake it at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for 90 minutes. After our banana pudding bakes, we will put it in the fridge for two hours. Unmold our pudding carefully. And our recipe is ready. Look how practical and delicious it is. I'm sure you'll love this banana pudding. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Thank you for watching the video. See you in the next one. Bye bye.